Hey guys, Tech Made Easy, and thank you so much for clicking on our video today. Well, as you can see, we've got the EcoFlow 160 watt solar panel. Now, this is a folding portable solar panel, okay? Um, we are going to go ahead and unbox it, take a good close look at it, and we're also going to connect it to our EcoFlow River Pro. This is a really nice unit because it's also expandable, you can double the capacity. I uh, love this because you can also charge this via solar while you're using it, which is really nice. So let's get started. Hi, it's Al from Tech Made Easy with a real quick message. I just want to let you know the video you're about to watch is not sponsored. We went out and bought the products ourselves. So if you like our video, please give us a thumbs up. It definitely helps share our video and lastly we hope you subscribe to our channel and become a part of the family thank you all right guys we're gonna start the unboxing we got Brooklyn over here hi Brooklyn she's just hanging out with us right now uh, she's always on the channel so let's go ahead and crack this open and uh, let's just see what's included in the box so let's turn this around and we'll zoom out so you guys can get a good picture of what's included all right, take a good close look, look at this. So uh, nice fabric. This is the first time I've had my hands on uh, the panel. So I'm excited I got it at on sale, Black Friday sale. So let me uh, just take this stuff out and try not to waste your time. But let's take a close look. All right, look at this first of all. I'll tell you, what a nice handle. And look at this zipper as well. I mean, it's almost like, you know, it's got a little seal on it. So that's nice. They definitely put some quality into this. This is a really nice bag. I did a review on a solar panel uh, not too long ago, or a folding solar panel. That was nice, but EcoFlow seems to really step up their game when it comes to the quality. So uh, let's go ahead, open this up. I mean, even the handle itself is made nice. It's kind of like a vinyl or leather. I don't think it's leather, but, you know, again, made really nice. Let's zipper this. All right, so it uh, stops here, and then it basically will pull down all the way over here. All right. Take it out of the bag. Now, I believe this uh, panel has simply got your MC4s, and that's it. I don't think they complicate it with some kind of box that you have to have adapters for. So look at that. You've got your MC4 cables, okay? Um, you know, I hear this performs well also, which I'm very excited about, and I'm hoping that's true. But look at the panel itself, really nice. Uh, a couple of areas to uh, actually mount this, if you're gonna mount it, which is really nice on all the corners. I like that, all right? They put a little cushion in between here. So that's a good idea. I'll maybe save that to put it back in, but um, I'll go ahead and set this up. We'll take a look at it together. Give me one moment. One thing we wanna show you also is, is this carry bag is also a stand for the solar panel. One side is hard, the other side is soft. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna lay the soft side down and the top side basically has hooks okay so i would recommend connecting the top hooks to the solar panel in the middle okay and then you're going to basically lean this so it actually holds the solar panel so you're going to see how we have it set up in a little while but the solar panel will hook into here and pretty much angle all right so you know you normally would keep the solar panel in a good angle but uh, yeah, this actually ends up being a really nice stand. And then we, of course, use some end tables later on. You'll see that in a moment. But we just wanted to share that with you. Let's go ahead and show you. All right, so the panel is set up, and I'm going to plug in the power station in a moment. This bag that this comes with actually becomes a stand, okay? So you just use these clips here and angle it. And as you can see, I've got it pulled out most of the way so that the back actually tilts and holds it in place. It's not perfect, but it's a good idea. And it's just, you know, otherwise you can hang it, right? Because it's got plenty of these holes, but that's really nice. Let's plug in the solar panel 
and see what kind of wattage we get. All right, connecting the MC4s is real simple. They're male and female. So from the solar panel, I'm gonna go ahead and connect this male and female. And all you wanna do is make sure it, it, it clicks in. Do the same thing for the other. All right. Nice and tight. All right, so I am getting 121 watts out of a 160 watt panel. I got good sun. The panel's not even heated up all the way. I believe that helps too. So 121, and let's just take a look, you know, at the angle that I did here. So I just pulled it out outside of the shell of the case. As you can see, I got that as straight as I could. And I took the bottom out of the edge of the case. So I've got a real good angle here. I'm gonna try one more thing. I'm gonna take this panel and I'm gonna lean it against those tables in a different angle and see if I get more wattage. All right, as you can see, I set up the solar panels with these end tables. I wanted to get a better angle. All right, so let's see what type of wattage we get right now with the solar panels angled in a different way. All right, let's take a look. And uh, wow. Okay, 130 watts input coming in, 131. Definitely was worth changing the uh, angle. And I'll tell you, you know, the sun is really strong, but we were able to get a better angle. Um, and look at the sun. It's really, really strong. Uh, there's really very few clouds. So it worked out. I'm glad we did this test. Wow, were well, we actually impressed we would highly recommend this panel based off of today's testing. Obviously, it's not long term, but we just got this and we got it at a good price. You know, this is a 160 watt panel. You, you never come close to the wattage that they state, but to get 131 watts out of this panel is phenomenal. So what we'll do is we'll put some links in the description for some EcoFlow panels because these are really nice. We'll put the MC4 disconnector tool in there as well because you need this. And I will also put a couple of links for some EcoFlow power stations. Right now it is uh, December. They're on sale. You'll get some good prices. All right. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you did, give us a thumbs up. That really helps the channel, to be honest with you. Share our video. And lastly, definitely subscribe. We would love to have you as a subscriber. Also, if you have any questions or comments, Post them down below. We love chatting with you guys. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Hey guys, take a moment and give us a thumbs up. We really appreciate it. As you can see, Brooklyn, she's waving her tail for you. Take a moment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell and you'll get notified of new videos we come out with. Also, follow us and contact us on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. We'd love to have you. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day.